YouTube, back again today for our Origins Bonanza coverage. We're talking with Chris right now from Calliope Games. We are about to learn about Capital City from James Ernest. That's right, Capital City. You get to build the best Old West. So here in Capital City, there's a lot going on. The first thing you're going to do, you'll notice there's priority cards. Six down to one if you're playing a six-player game. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to take your coins and you're going to bid for player order. If you don't want to be the last one, throw a coin on there. It goes to the next player. Maybe they don't want it. It goes to the next player. They say, yes, I will take that. They will take the coins and the card and be the last one. And then you continue on and you bid to get your player order. Now, it's important to be in the early player order, number one, because the next thing you do is there's a train a coming. The train has different potential townsfolk coming. So the first player is going to get the first chance to draft off the train. And each of the families, each of the colors has a different creature representing it. You see on the back what they are, but you don't know the exact characters until you draft. So if I go ahead and I say, I'm going to draft Esther Carey here. Goes to the next player in player order. They're going to take one and pass it, and they'll keep going until there's only one left, and that person's a hobo and gets thrown away. So then, again, in player order, you get to buy buildings. So there will be buildings sitting out in the middle of the table. and It is all determined by the season it is. That'll tell you how many buildings you have, how many trains you have. But you can purchase buildings by paying the deed cost. Put it into your little area, and then finally each turn, in reverse turn order, you get to attach your people to the buildings by matching the symbol at the bottom to the symbol at the top of a building. So the top of a person and the bottom of a building will match up, and boom, you've now connected that person. So Esther over here, when she connected, she was able to get four coins. That's wonderful. Well, remember, I got another Esther carry here, prototype, these names will change. Let's say I attach Esther to my building here. I now activate this fully staffed building and I get either two points or one victory point. Two, two coins or one victory point. And then all the other members of my family activate their buildings and I get their earnings as well. So you want to chain different colors in your town. The other thing is every other player now gets to choose one of their buildings that has that color family member and get the earnings from it too. So you have to be careful when you play someone, you're not only getting all of that family in your town, but one building per other player, they get to earn theirs as well. So it's a chain reaction. So then once you do that, you put it all back together and you start a new round. So priority is important because it lets you choose your family members, it lets you choose your buildings, but in reverse turn order is when you attach, so you'll get more of an opportunity to reap the benefits of other players if you have a later priority order. So it's a tight game. Every decision matters. What order do I want to be in? What family members do I want to take? What buildings do I want to buy? Every decision matters because the entire game is only four seasons long, and when those four seasons are over, whoever's got the most victory points wins. Money's great during the game for buying buildings and bidding, but the victory points are what matters at the very end. And that's what Capital City's all about. Over the course of one year, building the best Old West. All right, and uh, you said this is this is coming out soon? This will be out later this year. We're looking at probably just post Gen Con this will be out. All right, and uh, player counting? This can go from three up to six players. Oh, nice. Yes, you can play with... Uh, with quite a big group and it's a lot of fun because then you're really watching others to see who's playing what, what do I want in my city. A lot of fun. Alright, that is Capital City coming from Calliope Games uh, later this year. It looks like it might be your cup of tea. Be sure to check this one out. If you're enjoying this Origins convention coverage, please be sure to click on that subscribe button down below. And as always, thanks for your time YouTube.